Hey, this is Coach Aid inside Roosevelt Cross Country, um, episode five. I just got done with my Saturday run. Remember, Saturdays and Sundays in the summer are on our own. And when we get to the season here, coming soon, on August 12th, we start that Thursday after the quiet period by the state. Um, we're back at it then. So and we'll rock Saturday practices. We'll meet up, probably different location every time to mix it up. So we're not just stuck at our training grounds of Roosevelt. But hey, you're gonna see this week's episode um, just yesterday, um, which would've been Friday, in case I don't get this out, is uh, we did a six minute test. And I'll, we do use a point system of how far they cover. So I will try to get that on the next episode released or check out Twitter. I'm gonna start posting some of our summer, um, just little test results for fun type of deal. So I kind of rank them. And then, uh, whew, uh, we did a little tempo, got that filmed a little bit. Um, but I also did some of the athletes on Thursday's run, kind of introducing them, joking around a little bit, you'll see. So kind of fun. I'll try to do that more where we get you to know the athletes on our team. So that'll be coming more. And we'll get Coach Jesus on here the next episode too, so you can learn about him. All right, let's get to the good stuff. Exaggerate that knee drive. Take a few recovery steps in between if you need to. It's like Woodstock to the end, brand new villain Bob to the music, psychedelic visit My heart beat acoustic, moves like Kendrick Spark to a fire, then a flame man kiss it Go hard in my lane, both strikes in the visit To me and in the brain, gotta roll with the vision Vision of a good time, all I wanna know When the party gon' start, let the good time roll Come on, let's go, you got a lot of living Keep the body on the road, ain't nothing like the feeling When you're winning in your soul, the wheel keeps spinning Only got one goal, don't stop, stop the joke And stop, stop the flow, the real lane ready Cause I rock the globe, so act like you know Act like you know, act like you know Just what to do when the good time roll Love is nice when it's understood Even now the one who made you feel good You got me tripping while love is so Come on baby, let the good time go home We just got done with the 24 minute tempo challenge. This is Nathan. Nathan, what'd you think about it, buddy? Eh? Huh? Well, that's all right. That's getting better. Which way did you decide to do it? Which way did you pick? Uh, six or four, six minutes. Ooh, a little, a little further. This is Andrew. He's a freshman. Andrew, which way did you pick to do it today? Uh, I did four by six. Nice. How'd it go? A little bit of a struggle? Good? I was in the beginning. That's all right. That's all right. That's how we get better. That's how we get better. Coach Jesus, which way did you did you pick to do it today? Well, we both decided to go with the six times four. Oh yeah, and kind of kicked my butt there at the end. A little bit, I'll <laughs> yeah, just say. I gotta show you up. Yeah, yeah. I'll blame it on my older age. Oh, you got the speed, I got the endurance. Yeah. <laughs> Trevor, which way did you do the workout today? Six times four. And how'd it go? Good, amazing actually. Good. I That's was the second go. person to make it to the school. Nice job, buddy. Good, we're keeping you building. It's a good workout for you to keep getting better. Giddy up. Alright, this here is Jaren. He's a senior on our team. He's come a long ways. Jaren's also a member of Special Olympics. Hey Jaren, what's your team's name? The Lancers. The Lancers. So, if you can everybody, support our Special Olympics here. Oh, it goes to developing great athletes like Jaren. Jaren, keep up the good work. Thank you. Trevor, you're running smart today, buddy. Trevor, he's an eighth grader. He's looking to build and get ready for his middle school season. <laughs> All right, everybody, this is Riley. She's a... What? Yeah, you do. I don't. 
She's an eighth grader. She's been joining our summer program to get ready for her middle school season. And then Riley, you also play soccer, right? Yeah. So a multi-sport kid. So it's awesome to see. Thanks for your hard work this summer, Riley. All right, everybody, this is Cohen Nelson. Cohen, 10th grader now, right? Yes. Oh, yes. Um, I actually talked with Cohen's mom over at Pettigrew. He loves his mama, he runs for his mom, right, Cohen? Of course. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But he works hard, he grinds every day, he's here every day for summer running. And I greatly appreciate it. It's what's going to make him better. Nice job, Cohen. All right, this is Bryn. Bryn, 10th grade, right? Yeah. Now, Bryn uh, had a nice track season. It's now rock and cross. She just got back from last week being on vacation um, down in Florida, right? Yeah. And she was running with gators, but she came back with all, all her limbs came back. So <laughs> didn't have to worry about losing any my legs, arms, hands. <laughs> no gator got her. Famous. All right, here's Clayton. Clayton's a senior. He's more of a speed guy, 400. We're gonna see if we can make that speed translate to 4K, 5K. <laughs> this year, maybe in track. We're on the 300 hurdles. I don't know. And we got Nathan over there. Nathan's a freshman. Nathan right now has the perfect attendance rocking for summer running. In the front there, we got Carter Jr. and Alex. The baseball cross country phenomenon. <laughs> it's got a cannon of an arm. <laughs> rocking a senior year cross. Coach Shane leading the charge. Hey, thanks for watching episode five. Stay tuned for episode six. Um, but next week is our last week of our summer training program that we can meet with myself and Coach Jesus as a team. Then we go into the state um, quiet period where the expectation of our student athletes will be to be athlete led. They'll meet up and uh, complete those workouts because if we don't get them done, um, we're gonna take a lot of the great work we did this summer and our bodies are going to adjust in the wrong direction. We want to keep adapting our bodies in the right direction. I'm going to finish with this a little formula to success. Stress plus rest equals growth. Growth means getting your body in the best position to be successful. All right, later.